Okay, so what I got here is the Premier Teat Bucket kit. Um, well, it's not really a kit. It's you buy their teat unit, which is this. It's got a nut and the washer on it. Uh, you buy the bucket. You can get, I think, this is a two gallon. I think you can get a four gallon. And then you can choose between a rubber nipple, red latex, or natural latex. I think they are. Um, I ordered some extra washers with it, uh, just in case. They say if your bucket's not thick enough to put extra washers on it. <clears throat> and uh, I think I was going to try to use a five gallon bucket. That's why I ordered them. But I just ended up ordering their square bucket because I didn't know where else to find a square bucket at. Um, they don't really, they, they'll drill the holes your, themselves if you want them to. Um, it came with instructions on how to do the nipples and stuff. Um, it didn't uh, give you too much information on if you wanted to drill the holes yourself. Um, other than it's an inch and a half hole. And they want the this part here up off the bottom of the bucket. I think I read somewhere it was an eighth of an inch, but I can't remember. I think I got it up maybe a quarter of an inch. I kind of marked it out about where I want them eyeballing it. And um, I got them about two inches in, about an inch and a half up at that center mark of the... I guess I want to go over a little bit. Um, at that little line right here where they come together, I use that as like my center point where I lined everything up. Um, I'm just getting ready to drill the holes. I'm going to move that over just a little bit more. About right. That's I ain't going to get them perfect. I ain't about doing stuff perfect. So we'll either screw the bucket up here or it'll work out good. on the floor in the living room. You gotta put these together. Uh, depending on which nipple you use, the latex ones you have to put on here first, and then there's a little lip that it goes on. Put it on there first. You can get a wrench for these. I didn't see the point in getting the wrench for it. A uh, big crescent wrench, I think, will work just fine.
fit. Oh, look like it could have been up just a little bit more. But I ain't too worried about it. teats they're flat they don't have that little round roundness to them what you do with them is you just pop them in the nut part of it like that and stick your other end of that in there and just tighten her down two teeth in it. It comes with, it doesn't come with a lid, you gotta buy the lid separate. Um, but, yeah, there it is. I think they said you can put up to six nipples on these. Because they recommend that you hang it like that, flat against the wall. So, that's why I went with the square bucket instead of doing, trying to do a round bucket so I could hang it on the wall better. Getting that ready, I got them kids that I think are going to be needing it, so um, I figured I'd get it ready for them. So, anyways, that's how you put that together. At least how I put it together. I, they got videos on their website. If you want to go to their website. picking that up good. I ain't getting paid by them to promote them, so I just uh, sharing some stuff. Something that I bought I thought was pretty cool. They got other stuff out there uh, for it makes a milk replacer and it's for it's automatic. It's pretty cool. Definitely way out there for what I need, but bucket will work just fine, I think. So anyways, thanks for watching.